Dun, 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 dun. There's Nate calling me now. So we're gonna go pick Nate up. I'm gonna meet Nate up by the by the lake. We're gonna go to stop, grab some bait, make sure to have bait, grab some minnows, grab some shiners. I got the truck backed up. Auger, bags in there, buckets in there, sleds in there, shanties in there. I'm gonna be in there in a minute. I'm gonna get on the road, and then I will see you at the lake. All right, folks, we are here. Just made it out to the lake, and it is cold. It is now three degrees, just after seven. Three degrees. Three degrees. Ah, gloves. Damn, very important. Gloves are very important today. Everything's very important today. I don't have a jacket on. We're still gonna go out there. We just need to make sure that this ice is thick enough. This is right by a dam, a little dam, so water's always flowing by the dam dam. And that's water over there. So let's check it out. You get a spot out? Let's go. See what happens. So doesn't look like anybody's been out. It's a little bit of open water underneath the dock. There's a little dam. So we know there's open water right there. How's it looking? It's spotting out pretty nice. I can feel my feet moving, but it's not bad. Oh ho! -ho! <laughs> That's it. So we can get through the ice right there. We may be going to a spot number two. About that big? About three inches, three to four inches. I'm good with that. All right, we are all packed up. Are Leaving all. the truck, got the Nate, got the sled, got the shanty, auger, got Frank, got hard water. We're rolling. Walked out there, probably about 150 yards or so. Ice just got thicker. Talking about five inches where we stopped. So we're gonna hang out there. We got this dam, so the water's flowing over there. Mixing up the little fish, mixing up the little food for the little fish. Little fish means big fish. That's what we're looking for. So, see if we can get on them. What a great day. What a great day. So we got some tip ups set up. Got the shanty set up. The sun's coming up. All we need is a flag to go up now. Got that one set up. We're probably about eight, nine feet of water. Set our shiners right around. Seven foot bar. Put this one in. Is it looking deep? Deep? I like deep. See how thick the ice is. Five and a half inches. That makes me happy. We can deal with five and a half all day. All day. Oh, watch out for that. See that? Glad we caught that. <laughs> it's fantastic. That's a good stuff. So what we do is just drop the string down there, line it up here. See how long we gotta go? Oh, we're about. There you go. Keep it a couple feet from the bottom. About nine, ten feet right here, nice sense. So we will go with that. Now that's all set up. What do we got here? Oh, don't play games. Just using regular shiners. 
Hook them right behind the door so. Hook the fish, not yourself. Whoops, gosh darn it. So cold. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm having trouble this morning. No, why? So we ain't high. Here we go. Oh, yeah. We need to be higher. He's a fighter. That's freezing already. This one has a probably number eight trouble hook on it. Shiner. It is cold, but we just got started here. There's the hole. Got the rod set up. Oh, Already got a couple fish. Haven't kept anything. A couple small crappie eating some gills. Good start. Good start. Great start. Nate's over there. Bait bucket. Got the heat in between us. Mr. Stanley full of coffee. Got the hidden let's, tick. Let's, let's take a look here. We got using the glow in the dark. Wonder bread. Glow in the dark wonder bread with the, the waxy on it. And you get them in. It's about a foot or two off the bottom. And I'm not holding the line, I'm just waiting for it to hit. And then pulling it in. Kind of hand lining it. There's one. Uh, this is what we got into so far this morning. As we're getting these guys. Can't even lip it. Can't even. Oh, can I lip the little guy? Can't even lip the little guy. <laughs> little lipper. Uh, it looks bigger when you put it close to the camera. <laughs> oh, it's bait. It's a little bait one. Oh. Back home. But it's third fish on this waxy. So we'll keep throwing it down. See what's going on. If you watch that hit detector. Boop. There's one. Yeah, I got his, got his twin brother. He definitely won't complain with Oops! Whoa! Look at that, another fish. Same fish. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. He's a feisty one. Another little guy. What? Keep throwing them back till we get something bigger. Oh, they're coming. They're there. This is, we've only been here for seven minutes in the shanty. There's a hit marker. There's the fish. It's a little bigger one. It's a little bigger kill. Oh, yeah. It's a nice one. That's, there we go. That's a, that's a starter. Frank. Look at that. Look at that. He inhaled. Oops. Gosh, I'm terrible. And holding these guys. I need I gotta get the, the things out for this guy. Look at this guy. He inhaled that little guy. I had to get the forceps out for him. Get the forceps out for a gill before. buddy there we go whoops <laughs> and he's gone we got Nate over there we brought in the little bluegill honey hole and I say the little bluegill that's what I meant <laughs> it's got a little guy on oh a little bitty purple bit. color man a little bitty guy that's crazy, right behind that uh, that lower fin. Yeah. Keep on forgetting what that's called, but dorsal. It's up. That's on top. <laughs> I didn't even look at those can't even tip ups yet. Can't, can't do anything. Can't do nothing. It's so hard. It's so hard catching a bunch of little fish. Look at that. And oops. Watch the hit marker. There it goes. Oh, and he took it. I was too slow adjusting the camera. Watch that hit marker. There it is. Oh, that's got a little bit of weight to it. It's a little bit bigger one. Oh, look at that. Look at that sunfish. Oh, yeah, now we're talking. That's right. Now we're getting into the bigger guys. 
hooked them perfectly right in the side of the mouth. Are they following it up? Yeah. There he is. There we go. There's Nate in action. You're good, dude. Chill out. Yeah, little guy. It's a little guy. Little mini gill. Try to get some crappie. I know there's crappie in here. All right, go figure. We didn't have the camera on, but Nate just bad pulls boy. up this bad boy. Yeah? But what? Probably two and a half pounder, two pounder. Probably not too big. Probably about two. Yeah, that's nice. Just about two, but 17 hey, inches or something. I just pulled out a little 12 incher. Probably about 17 inches. And then Nate pulls this right after we lost what we say was about a five pounder. Well, we got one tip up out there. All right, now I got to figure out the mess. Did you see that? What, you know, it's fucking the crap. I caught my phone falling into the hole. Holy crap. Anyways, we got the other tip up right there. And actually there's some bass in these holes right here, so let me get a line back in the water and see what's going on. All right, boys and girls, let's go check this out. We had a little bit of luck inside. We're catching some gills. That wind is strong. I'm sorry about the wind noise. I do not have a microphone. Just using the old GoPro. But we got a flag up and it's, is it spinning? Oh, she's moving a little bit. She's moving, you want it? He's not here yet. Nate's not here yet. Let's check her out. Oh, it took off. Oh, it's a pike. It's a big pike. Get, bust that hole out. Here's the hole. Here's the hole. Right. Keep your hands on there. Tight lines. Grab, grab, grab. Get. Woo! Oh, leave it. Yeah, buddy. Woo -hoo -hoo. We gotta get him back in quick. What? I mean, I can only keep this. Woo hoo hoo hoo! Look at that bad boy right there! Ha <laughs> That's a pike, ladies and gentlemen. That's a big bad boy. Here, let's get the hook out of him. Hold on. Where's the hook at? Did the hook pop? He dropped it. Yeah, he dropped it. That's awesome. Let me get a photo here. I got my phone in my pocket. Here you go. I'll, I'll use mine. Okay. Here you go. Look at this bad boy. Woohoo! I'm gonna get him quick measurement out too when Nate's holding him. Yeah? Alright. Get a quick measurement. Thirty-six! Thirty-six! Woohoo! Look at this, that's a beautiful fish. Look at how healthy that is. Look how fat this thing is. Jeez. Woo. Oh man. That's a great pike. 36. His eyes are freezing over. You want to dip him real quick? And just as we sit down, Nate drops down the minnow and pulls out Mr. Bassy Bass. Little guy. Nice little bass. 12, 14 inches. Nice color. Get him back in the hole. He go. Jeez. Catch more bass to panfish. Oh, jeez. I think it hit it hard, but it's just got to be a little guy. No, wait. Look at this thing. That thing just bent the rod. Well, I don't know about bent the rod, but it hit it harder than I thought. <sighs> Give me that back. Still using the same little guy with the... Oh, look how cute he is. Put him back. Oh, there you go. It's all the little guys. All the little bitty guys. What? Yeah, Catching all the little guys. 
Better than catching nothing. On three, four, what is this? Four, five flags? Something. Only two fish off of them. Four flags, two fish, a partridge in a pear tree. Let's see what we got. Nate's gonna grab this one. If he hurries up. If not, we'll just lose a fish. No big deal. Out to the side. Oh, there it goes. Just pull it away. I went that way. There we go. We got weight. Did he lost it? Yep. Oh, no. He's there. Oh, he's there. Oh, look at the little bass. Little bass, buddy. Turn up. There, Nate's cleaning them off. There you go. A 16 incher. Probably weighs about a pound, yeah, but it's still much. pretty. Not much. They're nice, they're nice color, nice lines on them. Good. Release. And he jumps out of the hole! You're going the wrong way there, Larry! <laughs> All right, now we're getting into a little bit bigger uh, panfish here. This little gill. That's nice little gill. Inhaled that bait. We just switched some baits, got slow for 15 minutes, which wasn't our liking. So I switched over to this little, what is that? A little pink guy? Green dots? Oh, no camera rolling again because we just got back from my failed tip up attempt. Dropped down and got that slab. They're looking good. Pretty colors, real nice looking. Drop them back down, see if we can't find some more. All right, spot number three. Just sat down, dropped the lines in the water, and we got a flag up. You can't see that yet, but it's out there, trust me. Let Nate take this one. And oh, is even off to the side? I see it pulling anything. Yeah, there's something there, bro. Set it, forget it. Yeah. Let it take it. Let it run it. Let it run it. When you feel it, hit it. There he goes. That was a nice strike, Nate. Bass. Oh, he engulfed that bad thing. Pushing him up. Get him out. There we go. There you go, buddy. Look at that. That's a good one. Nice uh, couple pounder. And there you go, there's a safe release. Love that safe release. All right, bravo, son. Nice, Woo. nice. Boom. We gotta cool that. be cool, that will pop now. Spot number three, back in the shanty. And uh, caught a couple fish already. Caught that nice bass. And Four minutes ago. All right, it was this big. It's like this big. Bluegill, never saw one that big before. Jeez, just smashed it. Little one too. Look at this. Oh, that's bait. Oh, a little bait one just smashed it. You wanna put it on that middle tip up? Yeah. <laughs> uh, this is the same, same waxy. Three fish, one waxy. Sounds like a movie I saw one time. Jeez, there you go. There's a bigger brat. Not too big, but still decent. Hitting it right there. You go. Perfect. Perfect hook set. Right on top of it. Right on the top of it. See if I can get four on one waxy.
felt that one. <laughs> Hold on, buddy. Four fish, one way actually. They're all tiny, but it's still a fun game to play. There we go. Oh, I think he just took that waxy. Yeah, it's gone. Oh, no, there's a piece of it on there still. Very little piece. <laughs> See, fishing like this is fun. Uh oh. Five fish, one wax, you still got it. Seven minutes since the last flag. Two minutes after my five five sunfish on one grub and one waxy. We got another flag up. I don't know, man. It's way over there. This is what they did last time. They took it to the weeds and dropped it. It was spinning when I got here, though. I don't know. I don't think it's on there. I don't think it's on there. Feel anything? No. Oh, maybe I do. Yeah. Maybe I right. do. Way to be patient, Frank. Ah, oh, another bass. Another little bass. Look at that. Bass all over. There's our, these are everywhere. Engulfed. Engulfed that minnow. The big treble hook too. Right at the top up. I got the hook out, the minnow's stuck. <laughs> there you go, right at the top of the mouth. There you go. It's a nice one. He's gone. Man, he took off. Alright. Boom. Did I get something? Oh my gosh, he's got to be the smallest one ever. Oh, it's you. What do you have me? Huh? Well, you stop, stop, stop reeling. It's, well, I caught a fish, <laughs> and my fish went and got your line. Actually, you caught a fish, <laughs> and I got your line. <laughs> yeah, buddy. So technically, I caught this fish. So now I gotta put it, I'm putting it back in the hole, and then I'm gonna watch you reel it back up. <laughs> oh, oh, here it comes! Here she is! It's a twofer. It's a, I, think, I think we both caught that fish. It's a twofer. That's great. Uh, well, got another little guy. Just dropped it down there, too. Nate just caught a bass. And then there's that. Still using the red. The red. Yeah. The red jig. Oh. Another nice little gill. About five o'clock, getting dark now. Got the silver slammer on there. <laughs> Just dropped it down there. We weren't catching anything for like 10 minutes. Two in a row off of that, so I figured I'd come back real quick, see if anything happens. Oh, the sun's going down. We're all packed up. About to get out of here. Sun up to sundown. It's a great Sunday afternoon. Caught a lot of fish, great way to spend the day. Oh, 
Oh, the sun's going down. We're all packed up. About to get out of here. Sun up to sundown. It's a great Sunday afternoon. Caught a lot of fish. Great way to spend the day. Grab this, you got that. Say goodbye to this lake for now. But we'll probably be back. Make sure I don't lose that. <laughs> 